what is uh, probably the last plus R Salem Shutdown League anyways. Fingers crossed we don't have to go back to the Shutdown League. <laughs> Want to? Yeah. Maybe. Have to? Yeah. Please no. <laughs> <laughs> Justice. Yeah. The polarizing missile. Do you think know how much a uh... terrible for Faust? Faust has good pokes to delete them. Yeah. From very far away. Do either of you know how much experience the Kirby Derps has against Wedge? Or Justice in general? Decent amount at least. I've been in lobbies together. Okay. I am curious to see, um, something you saw from earlier, the Kirby Derps really, like, their go-to option out of, like, any scramble situation, not always on Wake Up, but, like, tech or things like that, is always some force break. So it'll be interesting to see how Wedge kind of reacts to that. I wouldn't block that. Yep. <laughs> Probably with a nuke, because it'll cover it. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah. That is fair, kind of the auto beat option. Yeah, you throw an upward nuke, he goes up into it. You throw a down nuke, he jumps up, and then it whips, and then you can just manually detonate it. Mm -hmm. And scoop him in. Alright, much more convincing from McGurpy Derps this time around. A lot of bombs down there to keep him in place. This is, uh... Well, I was kind of expecting that counter to lose to Meteors, to be honest. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I thought we were just going to come in at the worst possible time. Oh, so Dora losing to... Dora sort of trading with those nukes is really interesting to me. Because I guess it'll only really work if the nukes are really far away. But at that point, Justice might just be forward walking at you, meaning she'll just block the door automatically. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's interesting for sure. And yeah, the door itself won't delete... Uh, projectiles, it'll just lose to them, right? Nope. Uh, so what's interesting about the situation is that, generally speaking, Door's not going to get hit because the projectile's going to be far away already, right? True, you true. just I was get to the other side of it. Early. But, uh, yeah, yeah, it's happening too early and the nukes are very slow, so the timing needs to be very late. That scalpel did actually work out, though. Uh, hold wedge in place, delete the nuke when it hits the scalpel. It's real fun to watch uh, the way McCurpy Derps is moving, because, you know, Faust has all the weird FTC momentum shifting stuff, so using it to make such a, like, floaty, slow-ish character still kind of weave yeah. through these maps is cool. That's the thing that I think is really interesting about Faust movement, is that he's not, like, mobile in the, like, I'm going sense. He's mobile in the, like, where am I going to be sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it took a lot of damage, but at least forced that... him to stay still. Did that same side? It double crossed up. Yeah, okay. I don't know if it, it must have hit same side because it blew back. That was wild. Or <laughs> this game handles corner really weirdly sometimes. Oh, big punish. First. Oh, both of them cannot afford to take anything. Oh. And the wash pan comes in. Might have thought it was something else with a slightly different trajectory, but wash pan comes back right down on your head. You have to either go forward or hold it, and Justice does not have an easy time going forward. Uh oh. Oh, is that. Uh, I, I think that's just a stream. Yep, okay, we're good. Was worried for the player's sake. Yeah, that's probably just my internet, sorry. No worry. What a lot. Yeah, I like how the Kirby Derps is not always giving up space. Um, you see a lot of people against like the Justice nukes and things like that, they'll like the plus example would be, you know, throw an item, back up, throw an item, back up. 
Um, but the Kirby Derps will do it like once, maybe twice, but they're clearly like thinking about where they are on the screen and how much further back they have to go rather than just defaulting to one, you know, like the give yeah, up space the, option. I, uh, Faust has the reach to make this like for sure not a bad matchup for him, but, uh, you still like, if you should give justice work to or room to work, that's bad, right? Cause like, like Faust, Faust can do some kind of weird zoning, but it's this kind of weird zoning that works on uncertainty, and that if it's uncertain, something might not happen. And now there's three nukes on the screen. Mm -hmm. This is getting real close. Ooh, try, I think trying to bait the, the punish with the door. And that door was really interesting because Faust was actually outside of it, so it wasn't quite a suicide bomb. It was a, like, you either get hit by this and you die, or you block it and I'm safe, or you block it and then you punish and then you die. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I think the only thing uh, Wedge could have done there was what that like the dashing force break thing that just launches you across the screen immediately. Mm -hmm. And even then... Like, if I was in that situation, I would not be confident that the bomb wasn't just going off one frame after block stun. Be like, yeah, I trust the boss to know. <laughs> nice anti air pickup there. It's always interesting to me uh, when I see the Crypt Grips go for the item toss super instead of, you know, saving the meter for force breaks, because they clearly like the force breaks a lot, and they're putting in a lot of work. <laughs> so I'm curious what the, uh, like, the thought process behind choosing the super there is, or if it's just, like, a position where they'll do it a lot so their hands take over. Yeah, I feel like, I feel like if you want to use that super, because you don't really know what's going to happen after it, right? Mm -hmm. And so I feel like you kind of just, you're at a space where it, you're safe to do it, and then you do it. Cause, mm -hmm. ooh, good overhead. Ooh, got the gold burst out. So I just got a lot of meter to work with now. I'm guessing what Justice they, is what a they make happen who with it. doesn't get a lot of meter, right? Just because the movement value. Uh, yeah, I'd imagine not with the the movement speed on Justice. But Justice can do some real good stuff with it. Uh, two really good supers, two don't use the other two supers. Uh, spend it on movement, spend it on good uh, FRCs. It's a lot of strong options. Mutually assured destruction. Let's go. <laughs> the Kirby Derps has been I taking a it. whole lot of rounds with the Yeah, like, weird the bomb SD stuff. Bomb. Mm -hmm. I mean, hey, it hit. <laughs> if it works, yeah. <laughs> A fun thing, it's, I, the thing about bomb is that you need to, re, you, you need to remember, oh, uh, Herp needs the game count. Okay. It is, uh, let's see. Wedge has one, McCurpyderps has two. Er, I said that backwards. It is 2-1 McCurpyderps right now. <laughs> Okay, cool. I was saying it I and reading it, it off backwards. So. I, I probably could have used my brain to remember how, what it was, but also I was pretty sure you knew it better than me, so. Yeah, I, I have the scoreboard here, so. Exactly. That would be the reason I expected you to know. <laughs> uh, let's see. Did you really expect me to be able to translate it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's those are Arabic numerals. I expect you to know how to read them. <laughs> Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the bomb. So, th so the game of of just like deciding to take an advantageous bomb explosion isn't even just one that Faust can play. You can play that into Faust if he throws bomb. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just one of those where he's more likely to have the experience in that situation. Then there's me. I will bandit revolver into bomb. <laughs> I will carry my combo into bomb. Yeah, guys, yeah, so you know a lot about sort of similar things like that, right, Hellsap? About the, like, 
using RNG stuff to and like how your opponent plays around it. Do you think that trying to out Fost the Fost on Bomb is generally the correct option, or just kind of like run away, take it, unless you're real experienced? Yeah, it's it's very difficult to challenge because you know even if you know the RNG, uh, Faust is just it just is is second nature to a Faust player. Well, well, you know how to avoid it. You can get used mm -hmm. to it, but like the yeah. actual answer, in my opinion, is you might just not be able to do anything from it. Mm -hmm. Like if I try to if I try to if I try to do something cheeky in bomb to like land a hit and then put Faust into it and the Faust just blocks the hit I went for. I'm in bomb by myself. Yeah. So there's a lot of factors that go into it. Yeah, most most of the fast kind of play. It's an opportunity you take if you see it. Is the way I see it, and you kind of have to learn how to recognize it. Yeah. Like, yeah, but most of the fast kind of play, you know, it doesn't work well in this matchup because, well. This player, because uh, Wedge is always trying to throw fireballs, but you you never want to <laughs> stay off Faust. <laughs> you you like you like have to like always gain ground, and like even when he does the the, the bomb the bomb head, you want to jump up and block it. Most people might just like, oh I see it, I'm just gonna like block it, but it's like it's always more beneficial to jump up and block it. There's always small things you can you can do in this kind of matchup to uh, to make it easier to fight fight the character. But. Yeah, definitely some of them, like that example you just gave, are probably going to be harder with Justice's mobility specs, but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's still important, for sure. But hey, uh, Wedge pulled it around at that last match, so still a match point, but might, might turn around, might see another 2-2. Two -two. <laughs> yeah, and Wedge is, luckily for them, not fighting for their tournament life here. This is back in winner's bracket. So this is trying to punch a card to Grams, not, you know, keep afloat. The Kerpidurps is definitely not afraid to just chill all the way back against Justice as long as they have the items out. And I'm not sure if they're... Oh, no, okay. I think especially if there's just like a bomb on screen or a meteor on the way, why not? Mm -hmm. Like it's kind of a situation where it can be pretty disadvantageous to just be back there. But like, if you're, uh, if you've already know that something there is there threatening justice, then you can just chill. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, but, I guess uh, I'm just saying like good recognition from the Kirby Derps because I feel like mm -hmm. it's real easy to just get caught up in I do not want the zoner to have more than 50% of the screen from me. I will go in, but like the ability to kind of step back and be like, I don't have to right now. There's the bomb out or whatever. Is. Well, I mean, hey, Faust's the spicy zoner, right? That's a thing people say. Yeah, that's a... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, game five. We've had so many game fives today. Ooh, trade on poison, which means poison is still stuck. I'm doing a lot of work. Yeah, that is... Burst. Yeah, the burst almost got punished, but it didn't, and it got rid of the poison, so... Yeah, I guess you can probably just like gold burst that on reaction if you, or like in response if you really want to. Ooh, lot of risk on wedge, but Kirby gets uh, grabbed. Yeah, matters a whole lot less if it's right uh, on the person in control. <laughs> Ooh, not blocking on wake up twice. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder if those are both, uh, force break attempts. Ooh. Is that, that, like, situation isn't really something we've seen too much, but... Maybe, but that's not gonna work on a jumping normal. <laughs> Especially not that jumping normal specifically. <laughs> yeah, definitely not. Right, there we go again. <laughs> if it works, it works! <laughs> Here we go, push oh, him to the corner. My... This is a. This is not the time to not be blocking on wake up from the Kirby Derps, though. But that'll do oh, it. No. Uh, got a block, friend. 
Yeah, Wedge, <laughs> bringing it all the way back, taking it 3-2 in yet another Game 5 set today.